ओके लेट्स डिस्कस द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ एम्पेरिकल अवेयरनेस इन ड्रॉइंग इन्फ्लुएंसेस सपोज ऑल द इंफॉर्मेशन दैट इज गिवन टू अस इज अ मैन वाज रन ओवर बाय अ ट्रक इन्फ्लुएंस द मैन डाइड यू हैव टू डिसाइड इफ द इन्फ्लुएंस इज डेफिनेटली ट्रू और probably true or probably false or definitely false or data inadequate but the problem is that there is so little information available we cannot be deductive about this problem in the manner of a syllogism this is where empirical awareness comes in in order to answer the question we will have to look at the world we will have to answer the question what happens when a man is run over by a truck baba common experience tells us that a man who is run over by a truck almost certainly ends up losing his life but sometimes there is the chance factor the luck factor there are a few people who are very lucky indeed in a circus sometimes an elephant walks over a man but the man stays alive similarly there are some people in this world who have survived even an air crash we can never count out the chance factor yes vidya now we have decided that the inference is true on the basis of our awareness of the world we know that a man who is run over by a truck will survive only if he is lucky in a very big way but we agree that there is always a chance a very small chance that the man did not die even after he was run over by a truck so we will take the inference as true but we will not take it as 100% true and so we will say that the inference is probably true not definitely true but so how did we decide this see vidya there is no information except one small sentence suppose the given information was that the fatality rate for a truck running over a human being is 99% yesterday a man was run over by a truck then vidya you would have easily inferred that the inference that the man died was probably true reading the two sentences together we will easily get the answer but here even when the first statement is not given we were able to get the right answer we were able to do this on the basis of empirical knowledge this is because empirical awareness helps us in making extra assumptions which are facts not given in the passage here the extra assumption is that very few people indeed can stay alive after being run over by a truck now we will discuss role of prior knowledge in drawing inferences sometimes of course we are told that all inferences should be answered on the basis of the passage and not on prior knowledge or information that does not figure in the passage and it is certainly true that we can infer only on the basis of what is given in the text but remember that the text talks about things that happen in the world in which we live and so there is certain assumptions about this world which will always apply these assumptions are not stated in the text but if we get an inference following from these assumptions the inference will be the right one it will be the right one in spite of the fact that it is based on something that is not directly stated in the text we cannot escape empirical knowledge let me give you another example 